there we go. I think it's faster if you jump. Sure does feel like it anyway. Alright, we got your leaves, man. Ah, oh, tres bien. Oh, he's French. You've recovered all of the leaves. Now you must move, move this box and you will find your reward. Alright, that, that was a terrible attempt at any kind of resemblance of being a French. Oh, what's this over here? <laughs> Easiest puzzle to solve ever and I still fail. Oh my gosh. That's another secret seashell. At the rate we're going, we'll have the sword at half past never. Oh, that's not friendly. Alright, and uh, welcome to Pothole Palace? Pothole Place? I don't know. But they aren't kidding when they say there's just potholes everywhere. So, you have to. You have to go through a puzzle of uh, cutting down bushes and finding the correct path. Jimmy. You can cheat, you can jump, and slash the bushes. Ah! Like, I think we might, uh, just might do that here, because I think we just ran into a dead end. Yep. But, uh, if you do this, you can just do that, and, uh, making your life a lot easier. Well, I guess we can go that way. Whoops. No! I am being defeated by holes in the ground. And here we go. In soil sleep secrets beneath your souls. Dig! You've got the slime key! Now you can open the gate in the Yukuku Prairie. So that takes care of that. We just have to find our way out of here. Oh, come on! I don't even know what I was thinking there. That's it! Link is defeated by his true weakness. Holes in the ground. Yeah, they really make you take the long way around if you do this without jumping. So finally, we can do the dungeon in the Yukuku Prairie. And being that there are... How many instruments? Eight? There must be eight dungeons. In this, uh... In this game. Plus probably the last one is gonna be is gonna be uh, the final dungeon. <sighs> Sorry there. Alrighty. So we unlocked the Ukuku Prairie door. We do have to go around to get in, but that's okay. Um, we still don't really know any more about the windfish. We don't know why we're here. We don't know what the windfish is. We do know the townspeople are extremely weird, and that certain parts of this place just seem <sighs> almost just fake. After all, the town is called Maybe. Um, but so far, uh, we have no incriminating evidence. We will continue uh, doing the dungeons that the owl sends us on, and and assisting the local population when we can. So we'll pick up here uh, in the next episode. Until then, friends. Hello, friends, and welcome back to another exciting day of Let's Playing. Oh, yeah, Link's Awakening DX. I don't really remember where we left off here. It seems that we just unlocked the uh, key, or we unlocked the gate to the third temple. So let's go ahead and uh, 
traverse onwards to that. Although it doesn't look like a direct entrance is available to us in that location, so we're gonna have to take a route around and figure out if we can get in from the back. Or at least find a path to the front there. Looked like there was water uh, around the entrance, so if we follow this water, we should be good. Island hopping! Kind of like when you play Axis and Allies as Japan. Alright. We're in the castle. Wow. Creepy music. Level 3. The cavern. Doesn't look much like a cavern. Oh! Hey! No! Cheater! Alright, we're gonna get you. We're gonna get- Oh, fine. Hold on. We're gonna get this guy. Alright. Come on. Blast! Looks like we're not gonna be able to get him. Well, similar to the castle that Richard had, we're just gonna throw a pot at the door, because that opens it. Oh, we're in a corner. We're in a corner. Back off. No! It slimed me! Alright, I don't really know what these bombs do. Um, I guess we're just going. Oh, jeez! Alright, I guess they explode. We got a key! We got the key! It's so addicting to sing every time you get that item. No! Ow! Ah! What the? Cheater! Thought you were being sneaky. Okay, so it would appear... We can't do this part. Because we need to hit the switch that makes those blocks lower. Oh, we can't get the key because of that guy over there. Or whatever drops here, I'm assuming it's a key. Nope, not touching it. Man, there's a lot of slimes here. Alright, we got four doors and one key. I guess we'll just pick one. Here we go. Oh, hello. Whoa! Well, that wasn't so bad. Oh, we got another key. And we can hit the uh, switch here. Oh, whoops. Okay, let's go up. Yeah, we can get this chest now. You found a stone beak. Let's find the owl statue that it belongs to. Let's also go back and grab that chest over here. So judging by those uh, crystals in a that away direction, I would assume we get the Pegasus boots in this level because we need them to bust through the crystals. That's really odd. I assume you can, yeah, push that block. You wouldn't even need to do that. Okay, we got the map. But you would you could just jump off like that. That's really... I don't even know why they put that there. Oh, well. I'm getting tired of killing you two. So, we got another key in that door to the north. No curses! Keep your acornness away. Oh, gosh. I didn't even quit when I... Alright, kill me! Kill me! There we go. Dungeon music isn't exactly symphonic, but it's better than that darn acorn song. Okay, I don't even know what those things are. They're very strange looking, to say the least. I think they, uh... I guess they like to teleport every time you- BLOODY HELL! Alright, at least we can use that to kill these guys. Really, I guess we'll just have to sneak up on them like that. Got him. And we are rewarded with another key. A key for a key. It didn't really seem like we got anything out of that one. In fact, we didn't get anything out of this one up to the north either. Although, it did unlock- Well, no, because we got to uh, hit the switch. And uh, we also have this statue. Far away, do not fear, dash and fly. I guess we'll understand that later. And the old moving floor trick. Ah! Alright. There we go. 
know what's in these. Oh, bombs, cool. Wait, bombs? That usually means that you need to blow something up. No? No? No, I guess not. Oh well. Just checking the walls there. As y'all know, it'll make a different noise if you can blow it up. Gotcha. Didn't do much for us, though. 